Hey there, Mandy with Run Windsor and Windsor Gives here, and I am so excited to share an exciting new challenge with you all today. I'm here with Logan from Imagine Zero. You guys yes. probably recognize Logan because we work with Imagine Zero quite often for a lot of our races, and we have decided to partner together this winter for a fun new free challenge that is going to impact not only the mental and the emotional, but the physical well being of our community and beyond. So Logan, welcome. It's yeah. good to have you again Absolutely. today. Thank you. Thanks for having us and thank you for your continued partnership. I know we've done so much with Imagine Zero and Run Windsor and Windsor Gives and we just really are appreciative for all the opportunities that you help um, to help us kind of talk about what we do in the community. So um, I'm Logan with Imagine Zero and Imagine Zero is a community coalition um, made up of other businesses, folks that have lost loved ones to suicide um, and other organizations within the community, all kind of working to really destigmatize mental health and hopefully end suicide within Weld County or at least try to decrease the numbers. We do this with a lot of outreach events, um, social media campaigns, giving folks tools in the community to help with our mental well-being. So um, we're really excited to partner with you all on this challenge and Mandy's gonna explain what that will kind of look like. But really a big reason that we're doing this challenge during the holiday months is oftentimes around the holidays and right after the holidays when everyone kind of goes home, we do see a huge spike in folks um, dealing with their mental health and just really not doing great. Um, we also unfortunately see a pretty big spike in suicides. Last year in January of 2021, we lost 27 individuals in Weld County to suicide. And so a big goal of ours is to not have that number be so high this year, is to really do something centered around the holidays that can help us kind of decrease those numbers and equip folks with some tools in their back pocket to hopefully help um, navigate that dark time. Yeah, and so we were talking with Logan and the Imagine Zero team and even people at North Range Behavioral Health who are sponsoring yeah. about the positive effects of getting outside. Mm -hmm. And even when it's cold mm -hmm. and our days are shorter, we can still get so much benefit from moving our bodies. And yeah. it doesn't have to be outside, right. um, but just physical exercise in general is going to help increase all of those feel-good feelings, um, all the chemicals in the body. We'll go into that science later on throughout the challenge, but there's a big reason why we can partner together and make an impact. And so we chose the name Move Through the Darkness because we're going to move through not only the darkness of the cold winter months, but the darkness um, that's around suicide and depression. And we're not going to ignore it because it's real, mm -hmm. but we're going to bring it to light and we're going to fight it. So this challenge is meant to get you out and moving and you're going to log miles, whether it's walking or running. And we have five different distances to choose from. So you alone or as part of a team of six, which makes it very doable, no matter what your activity <laughs> level is. You don't have to be an ultra runner to do this. Um, you will choose whatever distance you want, completing a loaner, a team, 50 miles, all the way up to 400 miles. And you'll have from December 1st through the end of January to complete that distance. So it doesn't have to be a certain pace. It doesn't have to be running. It can just be walking, mm -hmm. but it's gonna encourage you to get out and move. And again, this can be done alone. So if you're someone that finds joy in self challenges and you wanna get out and crush 400 miles or more, mm -hmm you can do that. Also, if you like working in groups and you want to do this with a friend, a coworker, a team, your family, or you guys, maybe there's someone in your life that you know could benefit from a little extra challenge and some camaraderie during these, these hard months, reach out to them and ask them to be your partner through this challenge. So we've been so fortunate to put this challenge on for free so there are no barriers. Anyone can sign up for free. And at the very end, because you need a little motivation, right? <laughs> Some of us do. Little incentive. We love incentives. <laughs> at the very end, everyone that's finished their chosen distance is going to get a long sleeve, really nice uh, move through the darkness finisher shirt in the mail. And so then you can wear that proudly throughout the year. And most importantly, I think we all just strongly believe that with something like this, we can make a ripple effect and we can make a change. And so to keep you motivated through the challenge, we have so many collaborators and contributors who are right now filming videos that we're going to upload to a YouTube channel. So you'll have access to this YouTube channel where you can go and see videos from mental health professionals, mm -hmm. Imagine Zero talking about the stats and the reasons why, what to look for in suicide. Yeah. We have people contributing for you know breathing, yoga techniques, healthy eating. You'll hear from the Run Windsor team on how to start running if you're not a runner. Mm -hmm. What are the tips and tricks? How do we run during the winter time? Um, so a wide array of content that you'll be able to see to, to keep you going. So we're gonna open registration. It's um, 
movethrough.org. Sorry, I'm getting tongue-tied there. So movethrough.org is the registration link and super easy to sign up. We encourage you to spread the word, share your journey through social media, and we're gonna make a change because over 20 suicides in Will County is not okay. So we wanna impact that. And you know we're really passionate that we're doing a virtual event here. I know we're all tired of virtual things, <laughs> But this gives us power to impact other communities, not just Will County. Yep, absolutely. And I think doing a virtual event helps us to be able to do it all of December, all of January, really have that reach rather than um, just have one day that we're focusing on an event. So we're really excited to partner with you all. Thank you for the opportunity to kind of help spread all of this um, through your networks. And so be excited, folks. Yeah, so go to the event. You'll find it on Facebook, Instagram, share away, tell the others, and yeah. let's do this. Yeah. Thank you.